should be, I think. Hopefully. Are we live? Are we live or not? I think we're live. Yeah. All right. All right. <clears throat> so hey, what's up? And uh, welcome back to another episode of Realm of the Mad God with Chat Dog. Uh, I know it's been forever, and uh, yeah, I quit playing mostly for. Pretty much the whole time I like jumped in and out. And uh, anyways, I'm trying something a little bit different this time where I'll be streaming the episodes live while uh, while I'm recording. So that'll be done at twitch.tv backslash cthlh. So it's like Chitulu without all the uh, or Cthulhu without the vowels. And, uh, anyways, if you're interested in watching it live, uh, check out the Twitch and follow if you're a subscriber here and still, still down to, uh, play some ground and I'll probably still do the, uh, the old school thing I did where any kind of good loot that I get that is tradable during each episode I'll, uh, I'll kind of give out in the in the YouTube comments or whatnot uh, and then we'll see if I don't know if there's interaction with uh, twitch viewers as well and we'll see how it goes from there but uh, but right now it's really late night and uh, I'm not sure how long the realm will be open, so we'll just get in a little bit of gameplay here. And uh, I've actually I've never tried this this new set with the wizard, so just kind of giving it a shot here. It seems pretty good, um, just because the spell bomb itself, I mean, is really powerful. But um, wow, this. Uh, this spell bomb does quite a lot of damage. It's not as as much as a well placed uh, tiered spell, but um, it's still significant enough to make Godlands farming pretty breezy here. So this is the uh, the first I've used. Oh, crystal! All right. So we'll get some uh, some people together for a crystal. We'll just do it. Thirty thousand. We need twenty thousand more. Uh, I'll go old school on this and EP. We got this. Nice. 
Hope that dude comes back. I'm trying to, uh, well, I'm trying to record a YouTube video while I'm doing this Twitch stream, and I don't know if I want to do a dead water. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to do a dead water. Um, so I, I'm trying to get back into YouTube uh, recording, because I used to do a lot of YouTube videos, and uh, I just haven't had the time so I'm trying to kind of double dip and do a YouTube video while doing a uh, twitch streaming so just in case uh, I start talking and it sounds like I'm just rambling to nobody it's because I'm uh, trying to trying to make this a YouTube video my old YouTube videos were all just like let's play style um, essentially I just go into Godlands and like farm and then talk talk about the game and uh, complain about the developers you know the standard the uh, I don't have much of an issue with Dika as much as like Kabam. Kabam was way worse than Dika, but um, but Dika's. I mean, they're not. Uh, they they they're getting better, but they're still. I don't know. I I think they they still have issues uh, with well, you know. Uh, digging, digging the players for for cash. The mystery boxes are pretty, pretty shitty, and uh, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I guess they gotta survive and make money, but the games always felt quite a lot worse once Kabam took over and started melting everything for. Uh, for all, for all it's worth. But, um, yeah, I've played from pretty much back in the earliest uh, Wild Shadow, like pretty much when the public release happened back in the day, and then uh, kind of seen seen the whole progression throughout. I mean the game the game's gone through so many different phases that it's like not even uh oh, there's the UFO. Wait. Is it? What the hell is that? Oh no, that's the burnt UFO. Um yeah, this game's gone through so many phases. When it was ran by Wild Shadow, it was uh, it was just like a complete free for all, where pretty much all the players had, uh, I mean, all the top players had uh, kind of PayPal stores that they would sell all their items on, and uh, at one point. The Amulet of Resurrection was going for a hundred dollars, so those were just basically flying off the shelf of these like PayPal sellers. 
And, uh, and that's that's kind of what the game was comprised of. Was uh, the pros were all trying to make money. It was it was everybody was trying to make money. And um, and when I say pros, I, I should say like hackers and dupers and all of that because those are the guys that were always always the richest in the game. At one point, the leaderboards used to be, I mean, before the hacks became so prevalent, the leaderboards used to be uh, actually pretty solid. I mean, there was one time, I think a few people I remember, well, there was Itani, which was like the legend. Itani was on the leaderboard for like years and years um, as the top spot. But now the leaderboards are pretty just jank from all the, uh... Oh, what the hell? Just totally jank from all the hackers and everything. Uh, we could jump in a Mad Lab. I think we have time. Hope not to, uh, make a poor move and die here, but... Mad Lab's pretty safe to rush. Oh crap. Although, I haven't done it with these items. Oh man, it's actually... So the one thing I would say about this spell compared to the old one is the, uh, the tiered spell is better for rushing because you can smash these walls and kill them like instantaneously so this is kind of weird rushing with this spell so these are the guys the only guys that can really kill you in this rush are those uh, big gray yeah, those guys. So, you don't want to encounter a uh, door kind of like this where you just walk through and get completely shotgunned by that guy. So, we'll just go ahead and kill him even though he spawns a bunch of these shitheads. Uh, so, yeah, again, Mad Lab is. Pretty easy rush. I mean, especially with a pet. If you don't have a pet, then... Uh, I mean, it's still not bad. But better on some class that can heal, maybe. Like a Necro, I think is... God damn it. Uh, excuse me. Uh, better on a Necro for... Uh, getting some random heal bursts here and there. Or any other rushing class. I mean, I'm talking about rushing with the uh, rogues. Uh, but I've never been a big crap. I've never been a big a uh, melee melee player. Usually, I mean, I've always main wizard. So this this wizard's probably. I mean, he's at least seven, seven years old, maybe eight years, I think probably nine years old wizard. This is from like 2011 or something when I first made, when I first made this guy. I think, I think I prefer the old set for boss battles though, because the, uh, at least for solo boss battles, you don't really get as much direct damage off without your spell bomb and the, uh, just the triple shot is quite a bit harder to aim. So. Yeah, I'd say this is a... Uh, it's actually a lot harder to battle with this setup than the tiered staff and the tiered spell. So, I don't really know if I... I would main this. I'd probably use this setup as a uh, backup. 
And again, if you didn't catch it earlier, I'm kind of just testing this uh, ocean trench set. I haven't used it before, and uh, it seems okay. I don't have the ring yet, <clears throat> but um, I don't really even notice the speed bursts, though. So that's. I mean, that's not a. I thought it would be really noticeable, like when you play the bard with the uh, snake charmer. Put on the wizard, it just doesn't seem quite as strong. Oh man, don't lag out. This is. Oh man, I think we're gonna get. I don't think we're gonna get back in the realm because the uh, servers are restarting. So this might be this might be it unless anyone's running dungeons in Nexus. I've got some keys I could pop if needed. But damn, I was hoping to get like 20, 30 minutes in at least for a uh, video. But I appreciate you guys for viewing and, and watching here on Twitch. Uh, again, Kid Prince, if you're still chilling, and uh, looks like there's another viewer or two. So, thank you guys. Uh, I'll try to stream, I don't know. I, I can't stream too much. I, I work full time and I'm always really busy. So, I'll, I'll try to get in. Uh, I try to stream on Saturday, Sunday nights usually this time and uh, occasionally through the week but, but yeah I don't know if we're uh, if we're getting back in this <laughs> Dude, that message always cracks me up. Yeah, I don't think that the realm's gonna be here, so... Oh, we could do an arena. Could we? Do we have... How much does an arena cost? Wait, did they remove the arena? Oh, wait. Wait, what the hell is this? What is this? Is everybody on here? Would my friend Newbors be on here? Is this all the legends from all time? Hold on. Sorry for the... Uh... Jumping off topic here. This is pretty cool actually. If new boys was on here, then this is this is the shit. If this goes back all the way to all the way. Yeah, nope. Alright, so this doesn't I don't know what this is for, but anyways, new boys isn't on here, he's an old legend. So it's not the, it's not just like the cumulative legends page. That would be pretty cool though. I guess that might be too big. That might be the arena. Uh, basically leftover remnants from the arena. All right, let's see. Um, let me jump on my other wizard for public dungeons. So I play with a backup. I've got a backup, and then I've got a backup, backup. <laughs> so this is my other backup wizard. And I'm just, just starting to max him out now. Um, yeah, let me get back. 
back on this guy. But yeah, this backup got too big. He's up to like 2300 fame. So then I started making another backup for this backup. And I mean, there's not much to do. It's not much to do in this game. So you just do whatever, whatever you want. I mean, that's. I, I really hope they don't streamline the end game too much with the, uh, the exalted stats and stuff like this. It's kind of like a Minecraft-like RPG where I mean, you make your characters and then, I mean, they die all the time because it's a permadeath game. But then you just rebuild and you can. I don't know, build characters in different ways. I, I don't think you really need to buff these stats beyond where they're at. I, I mean, I don't even think they needed to buff these T6 abilities or... Uh, let me get a key. Or buff... Uh, like, the UBHP ring is insane powerful compared to... see if people want to run into him. If we have a rusher. Uh, maybe. I don't know if people even jumped in this. I've got so many tomb keys stored up that it doesn't really matter. Shit, do we not have a rusher? Oh. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, uh, rip. I just need to be it on me. Oh man. I I thought we had I thought we had like fifteen minutes. Shit. Hey, I think I think Bale. I think Bale look look for another dungeon. I mean, who cares? Might as well. pessimistic for everybody but I think we're not gonna make it
Huh. So. Well, this this didn't work out very well. Why is this guy trading me? All right. Whoops. I thought we could have maybe had a rogue, but we had an archer. Hey, Guffy, what are you doing? My, my cat's chilling. Oh, boy. All right. Well... I guess that failed tomb is a uh, a decent place to end the stream. Um, let me see if I can even get back in the game. Anyways, uh, so since I didn't get any decent loot uh, through the video, I will just do one uh, G Life pot to uh, to the first comment on the YouTube video that comments their realm IGN, and I'll uh, I'll be posting this video, and then uh, I guess in the same light, uh, if there's anyone watching that plays realm, I'll throw you a G Life pot if you're the first want to comment back in the Twitch chat here. Uh, so if, I don't know if the Kid Prince is still on or wants to jump on Realm after the server reset or if uh, there's anybody else viewing. If there's no reply on Twitch chat, then nobody gets that life out. Damn, this, uh, these DC bugs are really annoying. This existing connection was forcibly closed by, uh, by the remote host. Alright, so yeah, um, Anybody is in Twitch chat and wants a greater life potion, uh, please comment in the Twitch chat and you can have one. Otherwise, I'm going to end the stream and uh, just do the giveaway on YouTube. So, uh, alright. Thanks for watching, you guys. And it, even if you comment afterwards, I'll, I'll hang on. I'll stay on Realm for five, ten minutes after the stream, so. Alright, thank you guys.